Let's talk about lightsaber biases and conflict of interest. So this is a little bit of a touchy subject, a controversial subject, but I think it's worth talking about. So let's dive right into it. Now, my own personal biases with this channel saber sourcing and my conflict of interest is related to different saber products that I talk about. So I know my channel is very slanted toward Ultra Sabers products. Part of the reason for that, well, there are several reasons for that. One, Ultra Sabers is a very large company, so there's a lot of interest in videos on Ultra Sabers. Two, I have many Ultra Sabers products. I have purchased many Ultra Sabers products. And three, I sell off a lot of these Ultra Sabers lightsabers. So all of these things create a bias and a conflict of interest, and that's why you will see a lot of Ultra Sabers videos on this channel. Now, another way that I can be biased is some of the items I review on this channel I receive for free. Now, up to this point, they're mainly accessories like blade plugs and stands and such, but I try to say upfront right in the video, hey, I received this for free, so listen to that disclaimer in those videos. So, I don't know you guys, I mean, <laughs> it does make me a little uncomfortable to be honest that I have these conflicts of interest, but I don't quite know how to avoid them. Um, they're just going to be there. I'm trying my best to be transparent about it, and I think it would be very nice if other YouTubers did the same, because I know maybe you've come across this too. Sometimes you're watching a review video or an unboxing, and it sort of feels like the reviewer is you know really excited about it, and you kind of wonder, are they authentically excited or are they excited because they received it for free? So it's kind of nice. That's why I say, hey, I received this for free um, because you know I think you guys should know that information. But I don't know. I still do have the conflict of interest of discussing items that I ultimately end up selling. So I just wanted to kind of disclose that to you guys and get a conversation started about this, even though it's a little bit controversial, a little bit of a touchy, uncomfortable subject. Again, I think it's worth talking about because, you know, the community benefits overall from transparency, at least in my opinion. So feel free to post your comments below.